Right. Well, um, we're going to try this this um, Master Melee and Master Dodge quest again here. This is... Um, let's see. Is this the house? I think this is the house. i do it a little bit different this time. Kept having trouble that other that other way. We'll... Um, we got to go to the Dodge Master first this time. I think this is him. Yeah, this is him. Okay, greetings, sir. Yeah, da 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 Cocky bastard. Okay, so basically got to go save that lady again. Is it Blackroot? No, it's Dernholm. Did I get Pickpocket Expert? I did. Okay, so I already got that as far as I need to. So I'm almost done here, and then I can continue with the story. I could also get firearms up there if I wanted, but uh, it's kind of another type of game here. Okay, let's try this crap again because this was really. What the heck? was wrong, but we kept having trouble with this. <clears throat> Might just go in there and melee this this puppy. Okay, there we go. That's right, punk. Again? Jeez. Gotta be careful, don't want to target her again. Okay, good. What is this? Eh. Oh. I guess this is just ingredients. <laughs> so I agreed to betray this guy and I should be able to get both promotions, both Master Melee and Master Dodge this way. But you have to be careful, because you never know. Never know with this game, you could always screw something up there, so it's good to make saves every once in a while. I think I'm going to do that now. Let's go ahead and make a save right here. Okay. 
he actually shouldn't be that hard. I was going to disintegrate him, but I don't know if he has anything that I want to take. He might. I, uh, strong poison. Yeah, we could probably sell that. Oh, yeah. This sells for stuff. Oh, it reminds me, I need to get a shield, huh? Uh, quality broadsword. I'd like to pick that up. I can't pick it up. There we go. Okay, I guess I gotta go do this myself. Sell some of this crap. There we go. Oh, what? You don't have any... What? Let me wait. This guy doesn't have any money. So, you, as you can see, I've made Lee Master, and that, that is worth getting. I think it um, it makes it so you can't critically fail. Oh, I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Unless somebody else has uh, Master Dodge. I could kill him, just for fun. I don't know. I'm already pretty damn evil. Oh, he's running from me. Oh, that's funny. I didn't get a level! Pushing to heal the blind. Well, I don't have any use for that. Okay, so that was fun. Now I'm both... I am, right? Yep. Master Melee and Master Dodge. I don't think I need to get any more upgrades here. Eh, persuasion, maybe, but I don't really have any use for Persuasion. Expert Persuasion. Firearms, I could. Um, I'm not going to use Firearms. So that's it, I guess. Let's see, did we get... Uh, yep, we got all of that. Got all of that stuff. Go ahead and do that. And time to finish the storyline now. So let's go... Let's see, we went to Falcon's Ache. We gotta go kick these guys out of here. Basically, you just piss them off here. Actually, I can convince them to leave. Okay. 
And that was that. I think they have something worth taking, don't they? Somebody has a gun or something. Nope, maybe not. Money. Nope, that was it. Ooh, I'm really, huh, really evil. Hello again. Certainly. Thank you very much, Doc. I do know. You need to speak with my mother of these things. She will know what to do. She's just beyond the large door behind me. But be warned. My mother is a magical being of great power. Her spirit... Yeah, 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 okay. What's I gonna do? I think I was gonna put some something strength, right? Constitution. Was my heal rate? My heal rate six. Okay, so I don't need any more constitution. Let's let's max out strength. That way we can do a lot of melee damage. Hello, I welcome you, traveler. I know you've come far, and I've expected you for a long time now. I've seen you approaching from both east and west, traveler, and you bring them with you, all of them. They've no choice but to follow. I know, I know. We speak different languages, you and I. The things I see, wrapped in the past and the present, and shrouded in the veils of magic. I cannot translate my visions into your own. You must listen, Traveler. Listen and learn to see. What is it you see, Traveler? Yes, I can see them. But the ravens are circling. And the storm rages, but subsides. And yet there is lightning, and then shadow, and then the storm howls again, tearing. I can't even look at it. Wait. Oh, look. They've taken in a small child with machine dreams, and hands of hinged metal, and a heart in which coal burns brightly. I don't know on what you speak, traveler. Please, listen. Try to hear with my ear. I see a flame atop a hill, burning so brightly. And below, a field of wheat around a pool of water. And the flame spitting fire, and consuming the wheat and the lake, and losing... It's dark here. So dark. And the flame is here, too. But... This flame burns black onyx and cold, and shadow is its child. Are they here as well? I can't see that far. A plane of mirrored glass, a sky of white, a lone figure. Wait, which is the reflection? That is all I see, traveler. The riddle is created by you. Do you have anything else you'd like to ask? Min Gorad, an old name traveler. Oh, a man is screaming and carves a key with his fingers, and the birds have plucked his eyes out. And the wolf watches, motionless, his paw in the air. A tear in the curtain, and only darkness beyond. A ragged wound. Mended with a ring of blasted stone. A hand that sees, but is blinded. A man draped in truth, wearing a mask. And they hide I'm as confused as you are, guys. They hide a gray mist, even to me. But there, he runs, dropping veined and painted leaves. And the flock comes, talons outstretched, and wings of fire, and he is consumed. But the leaves... Run quickly, traveler. Find what was left behind. In the place of smoke and water, he is there. He is there. I see no more. The stream is again calm. 
the living one. <laughs> oh, traveler, why would you think I would know of such a thing? <laughs> it's an interesting thing about prophecies, traveler. They're no clearer to one such as myself, living both in and out of the stream, than they are to you, walking the shore. The flow swirls around them, until they are ready. And in the end, really, is it going to matter who someone pointed a finger at? These people can only see what follows in your wake, traveler. Pass your hand through the flame and it flickers. If you've tired of the mantle, then shed it. Disappear. Otherwise, don't be surprised at what people do. I know that, traveler. But I also know that clarity is often the child of time. Your answers lie both in front and behind. Make sure not to overlook one for the other. <laughs> Goodbye, Sylvia Brown. Hello right. again. It's so very good to see you. Yes. Certainly. How can I help you? And what did you ask her about? Black Mountain Clan. What did she see? There are two separate visions. The flame again represents magic, but twisted somehow, burning darkly. And did you say that the Black Mountain Clan was near this flame? The mirrored plain, a white sky, a lone figure. The worlds on either side of that mirror are the same. Who could say which one is real? Mingarad. What did she see? What the screaming man and his key represent, I have no idea. But I do know that the official symbol for the city of Caledon is a wolf, with one paw raised in the air. I'm not so sure. Remember, my mother's visions are shackled by neither our eyes nor our time. The events she describes might be in either the future or the past. Mingarad. What did she see? This one is the most interesting of all, and it seems that my fears may have well been correct. Do you remember when I told you that the name of Mingarad bothered me in some way? Well, I believe that may have been so because Mingarad is a dark, a dark elf name. Do you know of the dark elves? It's a long story. But sometime during the Age of Legends, many years even before my mother was born, there were a group of elves who separated themselves. There were philosophical differences, and they were no longer welcome in our forests. Those elves, they believe that this world and all of its races are subject to elven rule. They believe that elves are superior because of our close connection to nature. I believe, well, let us say that I don't always see eye to eye with those in Kintara concerning the rightful place of the dark elves. My role here is as protector. I will do so. My mother's vision of the lost children was referring, I believe, to the dark elves. They were hidden from her because they are hidden from all of us. Through magic and isolation, we've not seen where they live for almost 500 years. There was a man many years ago who had come to the Glimmering Forest to study the elves, and I remember that he was very interested in the Dark Elves especially. There were rumors about his capture by them and an escape. As I said, he was a researcher, a strange little man, a bit overdressed, but kind-hearted and very intelligent. I was young then, a mere 160 years old. He was the first human I'd ever seen. His name? It was a long time ago, but I remember because he said it so often. I think humans just like hearing the sound of their own names. <laughs> Terwilliger. Dr. Renford A. Terwilliger. I can hear him saying it even now. <laughs> she could mean almost anywhere, but if I were to make a guess, I'd say she was talking about the human city of Tarant. It lies in the Gulf of Morbihan, and it's, what do you call them? Factories? are always belching smoke into the skies. I don't know. It almost seemed in the vision that the flock who consumed him were more interested in the leaves. And my mother even said to find what was left behind. These leaves might very well be what we're looking for. You have a, a book! Place to begin I know it! Friend. it would yeah, I gotta go get a book in Trent. You're going to need to find the village it's almost like I've played this game before, huh? The only person who might know where they are is Renford A. Terwilliger. He may or may not be in Tarant, but it's a good place to start looking. You impress me, my friend. Few are those like you who would take this burden upon themselves. You've earned my respect.
Return to me when you found the Dark Elves, and tell me what you uncover. We will have much to discuss. Ha ha ha! Oh yeah, okay. Alright, so... Actually, I don't even need to go to Tarant. I could, I could skip it and just go to Kalanon, but I'll go to Tarant just because it's part of the story. I want to kind of follow the story a little bit. So we go to Tarant, and first of all, I think I need to stock up on more stamina stuff. Let's see if he's got any of the big stuff. Oh, yeah. Eh, eh, you don't buy that. Okay. Offload some junk here. So there's a book here I have to find which tells me where Terwilliger uh, was buried, basically. And I gotta go to Caledon and dig up his grave, which reminds me, where's my shovel? I think I have my shovel, shovel in my stash in uh, Shrouded Hills, I think. Gotta have a shovel to dig up a body. I think we'll um, stock up a little bit more. You notice I don't need as many stamina potions now that I have tons of stamina. Okay. Let's go find Terwilliger. You know, I'm I got everything except a shield. I probably need a shield. Let's see if I can get a shield. You know what? You know where a good shield? There's a good shield. I think it's a technological shield, though, unfortunately. Let's go in here in this shop. I can get an iron shield, which is neutral. Oh, okay. Well, can't trade with those guys anymore because they won't trade with me. My magical aptitude is too high to trade with those guys, so I'm going to have to... Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You know what? I don't remember if that shield that... Um, the, what, is, what is his name? Sebastian has? I don't remember if I can use that or not. Talk to this guy. Alright, we're going to go talk to him over here and get um, a quest. Which will finally get us... I think we Sebastian will join us at some point. Or we might be too evil, actually. In any case, we can kill him and take his shield. After we go get the book. I think getting this book puts Caledon on your map, actually. Oh, here he is. This guy. Talk to this guy real quick. Okay. Got to go to the records and find this Terwilliger guy. Let's 
try that. There we go. Okay, so I got the name of a book he wrote. Now I gotta go to the library and find out if they have this book. Which they don't, by the way. <laughs> it's almost like I've played this game before. Okay, the mysteries surrounding Robert Twilliger and his controversial work, Horror Among the Dark, the Dark Elves, many stories of... Basically, this tells you that this guy died mysteriously, and um, if you want to know more, you got to go to his house in Caledon. Pray Mr. Misk. Or actually... I don't know, somebody who had a copy of this book. Now, hold on, let's see here. Something like that. Yeah, well, we gotta f go find a guy named Mr. Misk. And he has a, he has a um, house in Caledon, and um, so we gotta go there. But first, that lady took some of my money. I could have just killed her and taken it back, but I don't really need money at this point, so who cares? What the? Okay, so I just got randomly attacked for no good reason. Right, well, I guess that happens sometimes. I don't know what their problem was. All right, this is Sebastian. And I believe he has the item I want on him. Ah, uh, it's a... Okay, yeah, this is a technological device here. So if I equip this, it's going to mean that um, I have a large chance of failure uh, when I attack. So, I don't know if I really want to do that. On the other hand, it is a good item. I'm just going to kill him. Just up and kill him. Fun! See that? AC plus 30 plus 30% 30 magic resistance. Huge chance of critical failure, though. So I can no longer swing my sword unless I want to have a huge chance of falling on my butt or something bad happening. So really, I don't want to use that anyway. Okay, so let's go. need to find a shield in that case. Should have bought that shield before I became too magically adapt adept here. Okay, what? Oh, no shovel? Really? Okay. So we've got no shovel. What is it that you I'm So I'm gonna go have to get a shovel. Ah, perfect. There's a shovel. All right, so we got the shovel. Ow! Let's go to Caledon. Time to do some grave digging. Oh, 
Oh, this guy's got a shield. Oh, there we go. I don't understand how that's any good, though. Shadow shield, armor class equals evil alignment divided by 10. That would only be 20. 20 armor class, though. This is 30 armor class. All right, so um, we're fully decked out now. We got everything. I might get, like, a ring of uh, uh, something that adds to critical chance, maybe. That... That would be one change I could make. But, no hurry. Is this it? This is it. Ah, wife of the late Victor Minsk. Or among the dark elves. What would you like? Still have a copy of it? Okay, well they say no, he was actually buried with it, but they do have a couple other items here that I want. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and um, off them. <laughs> there goes Virgil. Nice try, bro. That's not what I wanted, though. Oh, that's right. She had the key. I could have actually pickpocketed that off or I didn't have to kill her. Book of Durin's Truth. This, um... Actually, I don't think you even need this to, to go there. You could just force that. Wasn't this something? Nah, that's not it. That sucks. Okay. Yeah, actually, I don't think you even needed that book to go to that one special place. There's a place that you can get some really nice armor and, and all that, but I don't think you actually even needed that book to do that. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this in here. Okay, this is, um... This, I think, was... What, what grave was this? I'm trying to... Yeah... Victor Minsk, but his body actually isn't here. It's I think it's some somebody else's body. His real body was buried in in uh, Rose Rosenboro, which is actually up here somewhere. I think right over here. The reason we want to find this body is because we're trying to find the book that he wrote. <laughs> and the book that he wrote shows where to find the Dark Elf City. So I thought it was up here. Tell me I'm going to have to go check a map. Uh, 
Oh, this guy's mad about me killing Gilbert Bates. That's funny. <laughs> okay, yeah, I guess that thing was over here. Oh, come on. Ancient ruins, that's not it. Yeah, I guess it was right here. And this is a problem with with Mei Li, you you miss you miss a lot is the problem. Come on, it's right here, right? Oh my god. Well, I guess I forgot where it is. I gotta go check online. Okay, it's actually right here. Well. Should be right here. <laughs> what the heck? Wow. There it is. Jeez. Okay, now there's a whole thing you can do with using uh, the matchbox that you get at the beginning of the game to go give it to the, um, the innkeeper over here, but I don't care. Let's just go find Victor Mintz's grave, which is right over there. His real grave this time. think. There it is. <laughs> okay, this is the copy of the book that I need in order to get the location of Sing Ang, which is the, um, this is the, uh, it's the, um, Dark Elf hideout right here. That's what that is. Um, let's see here. What else should we do? I think we should sell something, right? Uh, I think we're ready. Yeah, let's go. Wait a minute. I forgot something. Doggone it. The hell? No. What the hell? The heck was that? I forgot a crucial ingredient here. Gotta have one of those amulets on you when you come in here. Otherwise they won't let you in. So these guys are the bad guys. They cause those those um, guys in the plane to shoot down my blimp. This is their doing. Oh, 
Jaw. Here's my amulet. Alright, well. I was going to rest so it was daytime, but I guess not. Okay, there's like a ton of quests you can do here if you really want to. Um, interesting stuff, but really I, I think we're just going to skip it because I don't need it. When my guard lady. informed me a foot soldier of the Malokian Hand was here to see me, I couldn't guess what you could possibly have to speak with me about. Do you think this is some sort of social club you can just join on a whim? And what plan would that be? <laughs> it's not that simple. You must prove your worthiness first. Simply slaughter every last inhabitant of Stillwater, and then I will answer any questions you may have. I look forward to hearing all the glorious details. No problem. Okay, I can't get out. I have to walk all the way back here. What the heck? So I gotta go kill everybody in Stillwater. Oh no. I'm a naughty, naughty boy. Um. Okay, so let's get on it. Oh, well, you know what? Let's wait till morning. That way we don't have to deal with locked doors. Go ahead and down one of these. Oh, hey! That's a nice shield! You know, i be honest, I don't even remember ever having access to a shield like that. I don't think that it's, that shield's even listed on any item lists, I remember. With DR plus 10? I would have known about that had that, um, had that been listed. Interesting. Well, you never know what you'll find in this game. Time for some weird religious people to die here, I think. Goodbye, Bridget. Right, well that that's useful. Ah, didn't finish staff, that's probably worth something. A strange choice of spells there, my friend. the guy that's supposed to be in here. There he is. I 
think that's it, man. We know when we're done when we get a fate point here. I'm positive I killed that guy. Oh, this guy actually has a good ring, if I remember correctly. Doesn't he? Oh, prowling bonus. That's a, not that good. I remember there was somebody way out in the outskirts, I think, right? See here. Ah, uh, there might be somebody up there. Okay, we got that guy. Um, that's there's no one in there if I remember correctly. We got that guy. We got that guy. Yeah, I think there might be somebody up here though. if we have to kill that giant in the cave. Ah, there's... Like, okay. Okay, I guess we do have to kill that giant in the cave. Actually, it's an ogre in the cave. Hey, wait a minute. Where do you think you're going, punk? I don't think so, bro. Eh. Drog Blacktooth. Die. Okay. So, I thought that should be it. Maybe I was wrong about that? So I didn't get everybody. Where where could these guys be hiding? Hold on. Okay, it turns out there's a guard running around that I didn't get. I think he's over here. He is. There it is! Yeah! Okay, so we did it. Let's go join the Dark Elves. Ooh, yeah. Kind of a pain in the butt, you can't teleport here. That reminds me, I can drop this damn shovel.
Where's the other guy? Oh, there he is. I am assuming since they were banished to the Void to construct a technological gate to weaken the ward separating our world from the Void. When they are finished, Aranax will make his triumphant return and set this world right. I like it. <laughs> After all those years of trying to concoct a plausible excuse to banish a group of dwarves, that young fool stumbles in there and walks away with their cherished technology. Aranax himself couldn't have dreamed up a better scenario. We knew Stinar would try to contact Bates, and Bates has enough wealth and power to make problems for us. He could possibly have even purchased himself enough mages to shore up the wards for years to come. Stenor had absolutely no magical aptitude. He was able to slip through the smallest opening without any danger to himself. If someone of Aranax's magical power were to attempt to come through before the rift was big enough, it would be an excruciating death, to say the least. Now that you have proven yourself dedicated to our cause, you must go to the Panari Temple in Caledon and speak with Kan Hua. He is known there only as the High Priest, but you will be able to gain admittance to see him by using his real name. He will have an assignment for you. You will receive the answers to your questions from Kan Hua himself. Okay, cool. Oh, that's right. Ah, I gotta walk all the way out here. Okay, yeah, this guy is an assassin here. He's in charge of the assassins that have been trying to kill me all along. And, um... Okay. Yeah, I, I could have killed him, but who cares. Just talk my way out of it this time. So, we gotta go to the Panari Temple in Caledon. First, I think I'm going to sell a few things. You can't actually get in here um, until you get 
to a certain spot in the story. So, let's see, is this the guy? This is the guy. Okay, where was the guy I was supposed to see? Oh, that's right, it was up here, I think. But you can do some side quests here, and I think I will just to, just for fun, even though I can't use the items. This is the guy. Yes, yes, you're the one, yes. <laughs> Impressive. A whole town, what? you see? Yes. Yes. I am he, Kanwa, the one you seek. I have been waiting. Yes. Aranax is pleased you have heeded his warning and come to our side, you see. Much you have heard about Aranax, yes. I believe it is time you heard the authentic tale. Aranax was the strongest of the council, you see. Strength and wisdom were his weapons. Envied and despised the superior elves the people of Endergroth did. Such was their hatred, heathen machines of technology they turned to. Aranax's pleas to their reason fell on deaf ears. They brought their destruction upon themselves by creating the Vendergroth device with which to murder Aranax himself. The response of Aranax was swift and decisive. Vendergroth was wiped from the face of Arcanum. The council screamed in dismay at Aranax's strength of will. The response of Aranax was swift and decisive. Vendergroth was wiped from the face of Arcanum. The council screamed in dismay at Aranax's strength of will. Weak-minded and old, most members of the Elven Council were by now, you see. If I must die, I will die last, you see? Glorious was his response, was it not? The final battle on the Black Spire took place, unleashing forces not seen before or since. was the fury and power of the combatants that the very fabric of reality was torn asunder, you see. Failed by the weakness of those drawn to his side, Aranax was drawn into the void. Yeah. All energy left in the bones of the few remaining was drained to create the wards to seal the rift. Even the great Nazaradan was unable to regenerate his energy stores after the effort. Yes. His grief and remorse for what he had done consumed him. Never heard from again, was he? Ah, you do not know, do you? Ernest, Ernest Erdine, in the ancient tongues, do you see? 
Ernest. Air, er, loosely translated, would be after the lineage of. It is obvious, is it not? Aranax was Nazredin's son, yes. All that is left are the wards, you see. The Ring of Brodgar is how they are called today. Weaken the wards we must for the return of Aranax. In this realm, it is what is not being done that is of great importance. Maintained, the wards are not, you see? Maintenance slowed, then ceased. The absence of expenditure of energy. The advent of technology has, in itself, hastened the weakening, requiring even less action on our part. Glorious in simplicity. Yes, of course. Ah, the beauty. The simplicity of all. If one needs to find ways to weaken the wards, one takes over the order dedicated to strengthening them, yes? Working at cross purposes is displeasing to the circular flow of energies, you see. That is quite the provocative query, is it not? Energies are squandered in direct conflict and eyes are drawn towards it. Subterfuge and manipulation are such that the subject does not realize an attack is in the offing. Ironically, the secret of my schemes lie with Nazredin. Neither here nor there, that is. Another line of questions I can answer, yes. But I prefer to stay away from my past. Perhaps I have said too much already. The entire corpus of a religion cannot be discarded without raising eyebrows, do you see? Slowly turned it must be. A being of ultimate evil is the figment of a child's dreams, is it not? Yes. Aranax can be proven to never have existed by philosophers left to their own devices. Ah, but you must hear of your task before you take your leave. How could it be otherwise? Perhaps you recall the heinous device constructed in Vendegroth, as I have recounted in my tale? You must retrieve and bring it to me for destruction. As long as it exists, it poses a threat to any powerful mage it might be used upon. The ruins are located somewhere in the Vendegroth wastes. Agents scour the vast wastes as we speak, searching for the entrance to the underground passages. Mark your map, I will, with the location of the gateway to the wastes and the base camp. Yes. All right. Well, I already got that, so we'll of it just go heard. get it from my stash. Open by one whose two eyes have seen it. The Ring of Bradgar is where we shall meet when you have retrieved the device. <laughs> Humorous it is, do you see? <laughs> my laughter is at myself. After a lifetime of mocking the prophecies, beginning to have my doubts I was. It seemed the Living One was coming to destroy the church, do you see? Yes. So now, joined with us you have, obviously not the living one, allowed myself to be drawn in by the propaganda I had. Do not allow yourself to be troubled. Retrieve the device and we shall meet upon the Black Spire. In the Ring of Brodgar we shall, yes. Okay. So, I already have the Vendigraph device. I went ahead and got that while I was doing my whole thing over there. Um, oh yeah, I don't want to do that. I'm going to do a little quick quest over here to get access to some items. Um, just for fun here. Okay, I don't really, I can't, I'm not really going to use the these items, but I'm going to go, go do it just, just in case just for fun here because it's so cool I gotta show you anyway um, let me see here uh, I could pickpocket this guy or I could kill him actually no we have plenty of these fate points so we might as well use a fate point
the hell did my... Where'd my arachnid go? Oh, crap. Lost, lost, lost. Okay, you want to read this too. And let's go back out. So I guess my arachnid got crushed. Didn't even notice that. Okay, let's go talk to this guy. Okay, so... Yeah, I think this is... I'm, I'm thinking if I needed any other items. I don't think so. So, we gotta go, um... This is to get the, what, what is it, Finding the Lost Wheel Clan or something like that. And when you go there, you can get, like, two powerful items and do a whole quest and stuff. So I'm just going to go do this because the items are so good that I at least have to do it each game, even though I can't even use them. But it's probably, that hammer that you can get is probably the best melee weapon you can get now that I think about it. Uh, the armor is definitely the best you can get if you're a, if you're a, sh a small character. Let's see, and I think this is it, right? Excuse me. Wow. Had a hiccup there. Got the journal. Let's talk to this guy. Now, let me take some of these items here. Basically, all I really need is that key. I forgot what the um, the eye stone was for. So you go in here, and you got to survive these guys, but that's pretty easy when you got disintegrate. Oh, there's another guy. Oopsie. Okay, so this is the, what is this, the Wheel Clan, the hidden entrance to something, Iron Clan or something like that. Uh, that's that's for a quest. Um, Iron Clan armor, my god, look at this, this is the best armor in the game. It also gives, well, in my patch anyway, it gives plus three, up to plus three strength, um, if you have the right technological aptitude. And this, this is an absolutely just bitchin' um, weapon. It's probably the best, yeah, I think he is the best melee weapon in the game. Even better than I have what right now, but um, it's technological, and since I'm so um, highly magical, that would uh, that would not really help me to equip that. I just have a bunch of critical failures. But I gotta get it just because, whoops, just because I gotta get it. Go sell it. Go sell it while I go get the Vendigroff device and finish the game here. Oh, 
Oh, it doesn't sell for much. Oh, wow. How do you like that? It doesn't sell for anything. Oh, well. Ah, well. Hmm. I don't, I don't remember what... Oh, you can give this to a guy in the rift and he'll join you. That's right. That's what that's for.